Hello everybody, Pines over here, and as you might notice, I got my mods back, and sadly my redstone world got deleted, so I needed to make this new one, and I already have a few creations on it. Uh, but what this video is for is specifically TNT cannons. So lately I've been working a little bit and experimenting with TNT, and I came out with a few nice designs, uh, and that's it. So this first design is a vertical TNT cannon. It shoots up, and it's extremely powerful and useful. Um, it's kind of like a firework. It takes low time to load, and one push of a button. It goes extremely high and is very useful. Uh, excuse me, I'm going to turn down the music. Um, only problem with it is that it is, it is slightly unstable, in the sense that if I will launch it and quickly go up, you'll notice that it's not directly above, it actually goes a little bit, um, to that direction. Same problem I had with here. This is just a slightly more compact version, but the problem with this one is that it went a lot to that direction. So what I did is I added a little bit more delay, and then I um, and then I used it as kind of a um, up to down style TNT launcher. I really do not know why this happens, but yet again it is very unstable. I don't know exactly where it will hit. And this version is actually a single single fire um, normal TNT cannon. It shoots straight, it is very powerful and easy to load. Sadly it is very hard to know where this one shoots to. Uh, for what I've tested, it hits around this water area. First time I tested it hit here, second hit there. So, I don't really know. So now for the second part of the video, I'm going to teach how to build them. For now, I'm going to teach this design and this design. So, I'll be right back. Okay, so first one we're going to build is this one. Um, again, this is the straight fire one, and I find it the most useful one. It is excellent for PvP. And it goes quite far. So now let's build it. First thing you're going to need are... is First of all, you're going to need an area. Uh, for building. You're going to need to build nine blocks like this. I built nine. No, I built seven. Eight, nine. On both sides. Then build this here. And at a top. And there you're going to need to take your water and place it here. And you have the base ready. Now you're going to need to take a half step from so of some sort and place it right here. Apply some redstone on all of this side. Note, this is the side that you're not going to be facing while you shoot. Take out your button, plant it here, and then run, run redstone around it here. Place here a little block of glass, just for being able to place it more comfortably since you will while standing here you will not really see this block and it is and you can't place it here so you're gonna place it on the glass then add here some delay I'm reminding you the TNT will be here put a block right there block right here and 
and then a few more repeaters. You don't really need to do this part, but uh, no, wait. Yeah, delete this repeater. If you accidentally put that repeater, it might it will cause a loop, much like this. So now just place a block here, and you're ready. All I need to do to activate it, uh, all you need one more step is to set the delay. Set all of them to delay of four ticks. Sorry if the water is bugging you, it's bugging me too. Place your TNT. And you're ready. Yet again, I'm going to remind you, this is not the most stable TNT cannon in the world. That's why it went so low. I'm sure that it's enough for you. I'm sure it will work better the next time you try it. I hope it will work better now. If not, it will be a fail. So you need to play a little bit around with it. And hopefully, you should be better. So now we'll move on to the next upright cannon, and I will be right back. Okay, so now we're going to build this upright cannon. I'm going to build it right here. First thing you'll need is a 9x9 nine nine blocky area. I mean, 9x9 nine nine outer layer. That nine by nine? No, that's not nine by nine. What am I saying? Exactly, that's better. First place a normal block here. Take a half step of some sort. Delete that and put your water. Surround the whole thing with redstone. Place some repeaters here. You will need four. Put all of them to four delay, except one. That one should be on two delay. As a result, you're supposed to have 14 ticks of delay, which is what we want. Place your button here. And then place an upright redstone pillar here. such you don't really need this to go over your head it could also be here but that doesn't really matter and you're done now activate it and have fun Sadly, I forgot to load the cannon, but hopefully that won't happen to you. Thanks for watching the video. I hope you enjoyed. Please like, comment, rate, and subscribe. It is really important. Goodbye.